Hey guys, it's Rob here, and I am doing another tutorial. Yes, two videos in a day. The miracle. Uh, I just really like these tutorials, and I I have a lot of experience with a lot of things for the with, uh, computer. For the computer. Um, so this is a tutorial on how to make, like, modern art, in a way, with the computer on this app called Paint on Windows. So you gotta go to the top right corner, go down to the search bar, and then put in PA, and then paint will come up. Click paint, and then you'll get this. So basically, what I learned how to do this is just put boxes just everywhere. Put boxes everywhere. A couple boxes you may not be okay with, so just hit Control Z, and then it'll get rid of it. So, you got that. I'm just doing this randomly. But, uh, after you finish with your boxes, once you got the amount that you want, uh, you have to go to the top left-ish, and then you click this bucket. And then you pick a color of your choice, and then you just spread the color around. And there's, le there's this challenge to it. Um, you cannot let any colors touch each other. Uh... I did this in school, and it's actually really fun. Uh, it was quite challenging at first, but... Whoops. But it looks really cool afterwards. So, um, I'm just gonna bring up one that I did earlier. And I'll be with you guys in a second. Alright, so this is one of the ones that I did earlier. Um, it looks pretty cool. I just put boxes everywhere, and then I mixed up all the colors... And then I put black outline so that it just looks like colors. I posted this on my Instagram. Uh, my Instagram is the same name as my YouTube channel. Um, this right here is supposed to be gray. Or uh, clay-ish. Whatever. Um, yeah, no colors are touching each other as far as I know. Uh, it looks pretty cool. Let me, know what, let me know what you think in the comments. But... If I missed out anything, or if you want to see something else, um, just let me know. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Once again, I've recorded two videos in a day. Also, if you want to save and you don't know how, just go to save, save as, and then you pick any folder, and then you name it, and then click save, and it'll save. And then once you're done with that, hit control N, and then that'll happen once you save. And then, oops. And then you can just start all over again. You can really do it with any shape, but I wouldn't really recommend it. Uh, it works best with the squares. Oh, I didn't even realize that that was a thing. Can I control Z in this? Nope. Okay. Uh, um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Uh, if you want me to like make a montage of all of the uh, arts that I've done. Just let me know, and then I'll just catch you guys in the next video. Alright, bye guys. Once again, a miracle.